Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. So today we will see how to download and install the R Studio software which is used to execute the code written in R programming. So we know that R programming is a language which is used for statistical and data analysis as well as for visualization. And R Studio is an IDE which is used to write and execute the R code. So here one thing we have to remember is R can be used without installing the R Studio but we can't uh, execute the R code in the R Studio without installing the R. So we need to install both the softwares R and R Studio. So if you are using the R Studio to write and execute the code we need to install R also. So let us start the download and installation. So go to the official website. So rstudio.com. So go to this website and here you can find uh, the link that is a download R Studio. So if you click on this link, you will be getting the two options. So the download options are two options. One is comes with the R Studio. Another one will be the R Studio server. So go to the R, download R Studio. So click on that one and see. Here you will be finding the two things here download and install R and the second step download R Studio. So you need to install both the things right. So first let me install this R. So click on download and install R. So here you will be finding a different platforms. So download R for Linux, R for Mac and R for Windows. So click on this Windows and see this is the first time. We are installing the R. So click on here. So you'll be finding the link install R for the first time, the base. Right. So click on this one. So automatically you'll get the exe file. So you can see download R 4.3.1 for Windows. Right. Click on this one 64 bit. Right. My operating system is 64 bit. So I am downloading this R 4.3.1 and immediately. The download has been started here. See, you can observe. So, download is started, right? And before it gets completed, go back and download the R Studio because, first of all, we need to download the R Studio. So, then you have to install the R Studio. So, first, let us download the R Studio and click here. And again, you can observe the second one that means the R Studio is also started downloading. Right. So it may take some time, but uh, I'm just canceling these uh, downloads because already have downloaded in order to save the time. I'll go to the downloads option and here you'll be finding the studio and R. So this is a R and R studio. So this is a R and I'm double clicking and I'm installing the R first. So R for Windows 4.3.1 setup. So click on yes and proceed. So select the language and selecting the English and see this is the agreements and click on next and I'm not changing the path. So this is the path where we want to install the R. I'm not changing the path. This is the default path and see user installations. So how much memory it will be occupied. So I'm just going with the next. See and here it is a customized options. So uh, if you want to customize the installation, go with the yes. Otherwise, simply you can select the no. That means all the defaults will be gets uh, installed. So I'm, I'm selecting the option no. So next. And this is the folder where we, we want to install. So I'm also not changing this one. So just clicking next. So this is a shortcuts. So create a desktop shortcut, quick launch shortcut, everything. So I'm not changing. So if I, I here, uh, I, it was selected for create a desktop shortcut automatically. Once it was get installed, the icon will be displayed in the screen itself on the desktop, right? So click on next and see the installation process has been started and it may take a few seconds. So uh, meanwhile, uh, if you are watching our video first time, so subscribe to our channel and uh, explore the technology. So let us wait for a few seconds until it completes its execution. Yes, 
you can observe the click finish to exit setup and also you observe here so there is an icon r 4.3.1 here so without the r studio now only we have installed the r we have not installed the r studio so still we can execute the code in this console right so and the, the, here we can execute the code but without installing the r we can't execute the r studio right so now i will install the r studio also so you can change the environment complete environment so click on yes so next and again i am not changing the path so click on next so i am not changing the folder you can observe it has been started installing so this is also this is also it will take some time a few minutes to complete its installation So you can see the console so click finish to close the setup so click on finish and yes already the R studio is also been installed so go to the all apps and here go to the R so you'll be finding the folder here see R studio so click on this R studio the IDE will be open here. See, here we'll be having the four uh, parts. So one is a script part where we have to write the code, and the second one is a uh, input and outputs. That means whatever the inputs we are giving, uh, the values, environment. I mean uh, the data set, history. Everything will be in the second part, and the third part is a console where we can get the outputs, and the fourth one is a visualization. That means the plots. If, if any graph is created so that graph will be displayed here instead of in the console right see it's a small program we have written same a is equal to read line enter value and a print a so go with the execution a run so automatically the value has been taken with the, this one right so i'll create clear everything here and i'll just execute one once again see here it was asking about the value sorry it was asking about the value in the console you can observe i'll give some 10 and uh, enter and next the value has been given right so here the 10 has been given to a right so uh, we'll see the complete usage of this r studio in our next session so hope you understood how to install the r studio and R. So without installing the R, we can't execute the code in R Studio. But without you installing the R Studio, we can execute the code in R environment. So this is R Studio, and here once again I, I, I will show you the environment of R. So this is the environment of R. So here you can execute the programs, right? So the R Studio installation is not required if you want to execute the programs in this particular R console, right? So hope you understood how to execute, I mean how to download and uh, install the R and R Studio. So my suggestion is install both the things. First install the R and the second install the R Studio so that you can execute, you can write the code and execute the code in this particular IDE R Studio right so hope you enjoyed the session if you are having any uh, queries while installing or downloading the 
R and R Studio. Feel free to post your doubts in the comment section. Definitely, I will try to clarify all your doubts. If you really enjoyed my session, like my session, share my session with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Thank you very much.